here we have our macaroni pie. So this is Carib the Caribbean's version of macaroni and cheese. So basically in the bowl we have our macaroni cheese uh, sauce we've made with cream, pimentos, ginger, garlic, herbs, and spices. Uh, a little spicy, creamy, spicy, beautiful. So we've thrown that into the bowl with the macaroni, peas, corn, the sauce. Uh, some cheese, both white, um, both both kinds of cheddar. So we're serving that with a little bit of the yam puree and then some calabash coleslaw. So there you go, see we're adding a nice crust of cheese on the top. A nice dollop will melt and just be beautiful. So we're going to throw that into the oven five minutes, eight minutes or so. And that's our beautiful yam puree. Uh, so we made that ahead of time. Again, ginger, garlic, herbs, and spices. We're just going to warm that up on the stove and get our veggies ready for our macaroni. Uh, long beans and uh, some cherry tomatoes there. So we're just going to saute that up with a little ginger and garlic, finish with a little veg stock, get them nice and shiny, and then take that to the plate. This little napkin to hold off that uh, that cast iron pot, which gets quite hot. So make sure you tell the customer. All right. So there's that mac and cheese. It's beautiful. A little bit of the yam puree going on the bottom of the plate, just to sort of uh, sit underneath that veg. Now we're going to bring those long beans, or burra, as they're called in Guyana, burra beans. That's basically Chinese long bean burra bean. So they're nice and tender. They've been pre-blanched, so that's just a quick saute. Better to blanch them because they can be a little waxy when they're raw. A little bit more than a normal uh, green bean that we have over here. So just make a little bed for those cherry tomatoes. and a little bit of the coleslaw and that is a finished plate macaroni pie calabash